Okay, Diane, here's our tools we'll be using. This is the wood burner. See the tip? And you have to uh, use sandpaper ever so often when wood burning to clean the tip because carbon will build up on it. And what I like to do is sand the piece of wood as smooth as you can get it. I didn't do this one that way, but get it real smooth and uh, the image transfer is uh, a lot better, a lot clearer. But this is, uh, I think it's oak I found out in the yard. But what I like to do, see all these different images, uh, this Tennessee shield, uh, a Tennessee balls football helmet, any type of logo or image you want to transfer to the wood. There's Smokey, the dog, uh, and one of my favorites is like a vintage uh, or a throwback logo, uh, Tennessee Falls. But what I like to do, I've already cut the Smokey out, they'll fit on there. And you gotta flip that and paint whatever image you find. And what I do is I place it on there And then, I'll place the uh, image on there and then uh, make sure it's going to go all the way across the wood. And then I'll get some of this painter's tape. And I'll, I'll show you why here in a little bit. But I'll put the tape on there and make sure I've got a good seal and that way when you uh, do some burning and you take it off it'll still be in the same spot and that way it won't distort your image so here we go and here's the tip once again it's a flat tip they come with a bunch of different tips and then what I start doing is just start doing like a circular motion. See how it starts burning the tape? Well, if you don't have the tape on there, it burns all the way through your paper. Just keep rubbing. And you'll notice it, it starts getting lighter and lighter. Uh, it's getting carbon built up on the end. And the tape also helps to reduce the burning of the wood and uh, increases the uh, clarity of the image transfer. See how it does the wood or, or the paper? How quick it'll start burning in. Let's look at it. See how it starts? You're just going to have to keep rubbing on it. I don't want to rub it now. Let's rub my sandpaper. I'll just take this. See how it starts to shine up compared to the black stuff. This might not be as good uh, as the image transfer because I didn't get the piece of wood real smooth. Just went to like uh, 200 grid, 180 
Let's see what it looks like now. See how much clearer it's getting. You just gotta keep rubbing on it. I think I got this wood burner at uh, Walmart. They got them at Lowe's and Home Depot and Hobby Lobby and Michaels. better it looks and then you'll see the spots you missed and just put them back over because the tape will keep it lined up I think this should be it. We're all I'm going to do right now for the video, anyway. Yeah. I could go work some more and make it better, a little bit better, but I'm done for now. Thank you guys for watching. Like me, YouTube me. Boop, blip, y'all.